Hello, it's Mampi, and welcome to our English News Edition brought to you live by RTD channel. Here are the top stories. The head of state received a Chinese delegation. And in Nobok, a heavy mobilization to find Mr. Mohammed Ahmed Ibrahim. And now to the Germany Merkel plan for Africa. That was the headlines and now to the national news, the President of the Republic, His Excellency Ismail Margali received today at the end of Tuesday morning at the Presidential Palace. The Vice Chinese Minister of Foreign Affairs, Mr. Zhang Yuzhu, stay of work to Djibouti, where he is accompanied by a large delegation of his department. The ways and means to promote and further develop the relation of friendship and cooperation between the two countries and peoples have been discussed during the meeting. The discussion were then extended to the identification of new poles of possible collaboration between the two parties after the mega project already endorsed between them, including the electric railway, the multi-purpose port of Djibouti, and also the new free zone of Djibouti. The forthcoming inauguration of the future naval base in China to Djibouti, and also the competition that this last is supposed to bring to the fight against maritime piracy in this part of the world, have also been discussed in the framework of this discussion. Finally, it should be noted that the question of the acquisition of the status of permanent members of the Security Council of the United Nations for Africa has been associated with the discussion. The Djiboutian Minister of Foreign Affairs and also the International Cooperation Mr. Mahmoud Ali Yusuf took part to this interview and to the Chinese side, the Director General of the Department for African Affairs and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs Song Tian and also the Deputy Director General of the Department for International Affairs and also have been other officials of the Chinese Ministry of Foreign Affairs accompanied by <coughs> Mr. Zhang Yuzu to Djibouti attending to, the, to this meeting. The Vice President of Foreign Affairs from China did not fail in his uh, intervention to stress on the ways and means to promote and further develop the relations of uh, friendship and cooperation between the two countries. The discussion were then extending to the identification of new policies of possible collaboration between the two parties. He continues emphasizing on the mega project already underlying between them, including the electric railway the port uh, multi-purpose of Djibouti, the new prison of Djibouti, the forthcoming inauguration of the federal naval base in China to Djibouti and the competition that this last is supposed to bring uh, the fight against uh, maritime piracy in this part of the world have also been discussed in the framework of these uh, discussions. And now the Djiboutian Minister of Foreign Affairs and International Cooperation, His Excellency Mr. Mahmoud Ali Yusuf took part in this interview. And he said the Chinese side, the Department for African Affairs and the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Lin Sengtian, the Deputy Director General of the Department of International Affairs, the ways and means to promote and further develop the relation of friendship and cooperation between the two countries have been discussed, he said. And also the forthcoming integration of the Fijian naval base in China, his, he continued to say, the Foreign Affairs Minister of Djibouti. The whole region of Obok is mobilizing the launch of Salem appeal to find the Obokwes kidnapped by the army elements who act in the north of country. These mercenaries are supported by Eritrea. Among the Obok and Kanabe cities were found and missing the seven sites and the situation of one of them is very worrying. It's it is a Mr. Ahmad Muhammad Ibrahim, who is family has no new since more than uh, seven uh, months. Some uh, claim he left his job and went uh, back to his uh, home, but nobody has seen him. Lots of people are rendering in Eritrea still uh, no trace of uh, Mr. Ahmad Muhammad Ibrahim. The population of Obo, uh, his family and relatives uh, are mobilized for having credible information on his case. They have launched an appeal to the state and have sized the authority.
authorities to recover their son Ahmed Mohammed Ibrahim. False information circulating about the, his situation about the family is in the total pro and request put the intervention and the support of the state to regain him. The mom of Ahmed Mohammed Ibrahim launched a vaporing appeal to find his cannabis son by the repellents supported by Eritrea. For the notables of the region of Abu Hose, Mr. Ali and Nkado, the mother of Ahmed Mohammed Ibrahim affected the whole region of Abu. His family and relatives and his friends have the right to have credible information on his case. The whole population of Abu must be mobilized to find and to face the armed elements supported by Eritrea who are responsible for the kidnapping of the civilian population of Abu. The case of the stage of these mercenaries who are numerous and in particular the case of Mr. Ahmed Mohammed Ibrahim engaged to an entire population of Djibouti. Still on the national news, the ceremony of restitution of the equipment for the support has to the regional integration has been chaired today by the Minister of Trade and Mr. Hassan Hamad. This lot of equipment is composed of the several office automation devices and also computing such as laptop and of projector printers. The Department of Trade and Small Business is responsible for coordinating the programs of regional integration, manage all its efforts to ensure that the institution in charge of trade plays a pivotal role. In this occasion, the Minister of Transport, Mr. Mohamed al has thanked his colleague for his commendable effort to strengthen the program of regional integration. In his side, the Minister of Trade and Commerce, Mr. Hassan Hamad, has explained that through these materials and with the necessary efforts are mobilized by the Ministerial Department. After the surrender of the Pitch of balance uh, yesterday to the different uh, CDC of the capital. Uh, That's it for tonight's news. Thanks for watching us and have a very wonderful evening.